Hello, hello world. Welcome back to my channel. This is Emily Jones, former paparazzi consultant. Uh, extremely tired and extremely sick. So, um, if you're new to my channel, thank you for being here. If you are a first time or long time subscriber, thank you as well. Alright, so uh, since my voice is leaving today, <clears throat> it's still not back. Uh, we're going to watch the Hidden Gems with Misty, and then we'll do the Sneak Peeks with Misty. But <laughs> I'm going to read the comments as they come up, because some of them are freaking hilarious. So, uh, my favorite one that seems to be on every Sneak Peek in Hidden Gems is uh, Peach's Leslie Jetter. She's constantly, in all caps, mind you, saying, I wish you would do these closer, like you used to. It's too far back. I can't see the stuff. So anyway, that made me laugh just a little bit. So we are going to get started on the Hidden Gems with Misty. All right, so let me make sure the volume's up. It is. And, of course, she loves to wait that whole minute before so she gets started. Curly. So here we go. Hey, paparazzi, it's hidden gem time. So these are items that are currently available in our shop. One of my favorite things about our shop is you have the ability to filter by item type. So necklace, earrings, bracelets, rings, and so on, or by color. So if you're looking for something specific, that will often help narrow down your choices because we have so many amazing items. And remember, every single day we add new product. We have so many items and every day we add more. <laughs> So, you know, I like shopping. I mean, who doesn't like online shopping? But when you see the same tired stuff year in and year out, it kind of gets boring. And the stuff that she's showing today in this Hidden Gems video, they've been in the back office for a week, a week minimum, both of these. This is one of my favorite items currently available in the back office. You love multicolored, right? Because it gives you lots of options, bang for your buck, so to speak. But I love that this mixes a darker color palette. If you see that olive green right there, it's really pungent and still bright, but it's obviously a darker tone. You see the gray, which is a neutral, and then we've mixed together that light pink. It really gives it visual density, so when you're wearing it, you are definitely going to see it from across the room. And again, it's going to give you that ability to pair with a lot of different items. Mm -hmm. Now, I love bangles, and this is a beautiful bangle set, but I love shiny copper. I think it gives us a lot of opportunity to... Okay, bangle sets. Bangle sets. Um... I was shopping the other day, and I found a Claire's Boutique in the mall. So I went and looked. A bangle set of 10 bangles with different textures, smooth, you know, stuff. Um, in silver, they had them in, like, gun metal. They had them in rose gold. You could get 10, and they were $3.99 for 10 at Claire's Boutique. Those... Or five dollars and how many are there one two three four five six seven eight nine I think there's nine so you don't even get the tenth one to mix colors together particularly if you pair this with coral or a bright pink oftentimes people are like oh I wouldn't think to pair shiny copper with that but it looks beautiful so as those springs colors start coming shiny copper might be a little bit outside of your box but a beautiful way to really add a fun color and certainly a lot of sheen. Again, these bangles can be split up. You can wear them together if you want a bunch. You could pair two together. Beautiful. Now this Beautiful. is a post earring. If you see here, it's going to be smaller in size, but because of the rhinestones, it's really going to pop out from your ears. She loves to say pop and beautiful, but you know, it's like, find some new words. Like artisan or antique. <laughs> and I love this little locking piece down here. It looks like a bit of purse hardware, so to speak, or hardware that you might see on a cupboard or something, and very dainty. I love this. So cute, paired with a lot of different accessories. Now, this is a beautiful necklace. You've got just a few darker black. You see that black right there and that rock? The vagina necklace, that's what I call it. Okay, so here's some, uh, <laughs> here is some comments. I wish the company would make bangles in a larger size for my other customers. 
Okay, so yeah, I, I get where she's coming from, that comment, because when I was uh, 341 pounds, yes, that's how much I used to weigh, I couldn't get the bangles on because my hand was too fat. All right, <coughs> now, you know, respectively, I'm like 190, 192 pounds. Um, I can get those on very easily now. Would I want to? No. <laughs> In fact, um, funny story. I was, uh, I need to get a new work uniform because my work uniform, oh, excuse me for the burp, is now way too big. And I was like, I don't know what my size is. So uh, while I was down visiting my mom in Salt Lake, I went to TJ Maxx and I tried on a bunch of different sizes of clothes. Now, it, you know, my my body is still thinking that I'm like, what, uh, a size 16, size 18, and those were like way too big. So I tried on a 14 and a 12. I fit into the 12, but I felt more comfortable in the 14. Is that weird? I don't know. Um, I don't know a lot of people that have lost weight and had to deal with not, you know, realizing what their size is. And this, this thing, this, uh, very nice, uh, athletic-y warm shirt. I just call it a warm shirt because I'm cold. I'm freezing all the time. This is a size large and I, I've never, I've never worn a size large in my life. So the fact that I'm wearing that, it, it still blows my mind and it makes me happy and I feel a little giddy, but at the same time, I'm like, I can't believe it still. All right, so back to the vagina necklace. Let's hear what she says about this. Rhinestone, it gives it more of a texture, but does give it a little tiny bit of color. It can be paired with a lot of patterns and very versatile. To me, this is very much a musings or a sunset girl. Last but not least, we have this beautiful urban. Now, I love the mixture of color. That bright pink and orange is going to be very fun. And then we've got this pull back right here, you can see. And just a just once, I would love to see her pull that and have it break. <laughs> Look like it does for most people. A couple pulls and then it's gone. Few silver accessories mixed in with that wood. This is a great one to pair if you have this on one hand and then you stack urbans on the other. Oh, and I actually have one more. Just kidding. Look at this gorgeous gold earring. I love this rhinestone loop. So it's actually going down and loops around, which is going to give it some texture. And then you've got these. Okay, those earrings. <laughs> they remind me of the altered jewelry <laughs> I made. You know how you get the free earrings with like every necklace and sometimes you get the the chain, you know, the three chains on a fish hook or you get like a, a thing of rhinestones, just, you know, one thing. Or you get the little baby rhinestones. Those earrings look like altered freebies to me. It's long chains. Because they're not, they're all different lengths, you're really going to see that popping through your hair. So if you have an updo or you just want to have a night out on the town, you really want to have some intensity with your earrings. This is a beautiful piece without being too heavy. Enjoy your day. Yay, sneak peeks with Misty is over. Thank God. All right, so now we're going to go to... Where's the... Oh, there's that coil bracelet I was telling you all about. Let's see what the photos are this week. So... People say you have her eyes. Some say you have her smile. You have the same sense of humor. Feisty personality. Hey, feisty, you might want to take a look at that. They're using your word. No matter which traits you inherited from your mom, she's always been your biggest fan. Why not show her that she means $5 to you? <laughs> Sorry, that's my rendition of it, but... Okay, and what's with the necklace on a either a soap disc or a white chocolate disc? I don't know. All right. Uh, love you to the moon and back. Give away. Comment and tell us your favorite childhood memory. No. Don't do it. There's nothing wrong with a little flower power in copper. And then sneak peek. Pearls and rhinestones have our heart in a coil bracelet. And these ones are made for the... Uh, for the larger ladies, I guess. Keep calm, call mom. 
She's got her chaos coordinator on. Are these really mother and daughter? We think stone bracelets rock. Nice pun there, paparazzi. Ooh, look. Um, this is the Fashion Fix subscribers. This is the Sunset Sightings Trend Blend. Uh, do you want this fabulous set? It's available with your consultants who have Fashion Fix. And then we've got the spring thing. And then uh, there's a shade of red for every woman, says Audrey Hepburn. Yeah, there is. Oh, we're showing off the Fashion Fixes. All those beautiful fashion fixes. And then, you know, the, the stupid... What do we call that? And here's sneak peeks with Misty. Here we go. All right, let me go in a full minute. Hey, paparazzi. And again, this person is going to say the same thing, but this time she didn't say it in all caps. I can't see the items. They're too far away, and I'm unable to use Zoom. <laughs> Can we have men's items in our hostess rewards? It would be nice to give them away to men as well. Well, you know, if they didn't sell out of those men's items, wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Uh, let's see. I miss the sneak peeks that were really up close. That view really allowed us to see the detail on the pieces. Here's the reason why she's doing it further away, because the quality has gone downhill and there's no detail to really see. But the, the comments are pretty much all the same. She's too far away. And they're not happy Hey, paparazzi, about. it's Friday, which means the weekend is heading your way. But before that weekend comes, let's do a sneak peek. So these are items that will be available oh so soon. This is a beautiful pearl necklace. She just likes to show off her custom closet because it looks like it's a custom closet. Maybe this is in her house or something with her marble countertops and her pink pillow. This li literally looks like a closet to me. You can see the pearls here and then the rhinestone underneath. It has a bit of a flanking look, so it flares out just a little bit. I love that it'll nestle above a lot of necklines. Yeah, like you can't see the detail. For so many things. This is a cute gift for Mother's Day. This is a cute gift if you're just looking for something to tell somebody, hey, I love you. It goes for a lot of style because it's Fifth Avenue. A lot of people can utilize it's a Fifth Avenue. pearl. And this is also fun for the wedding season coming up. So many fun ways to wear it. And again, it's delicate size allows it to nestle just above the neckline. Now, if you love musings, you'll definitely love this post earring. This is a high sheen gunmetal, but I love the Okay, I'm, I'm just gonna share something. So they have this like take your style quiz on the paparazzi website where they encourage you to go on and take the style quiz to find out what style of jewelry you prefer. Um, I took the quiz. <laughs> it told me I like sunset sightings. And no, I don't. I am not a sunset sightings girl. I am a uh, steampunk. <laughs> okay. Um, when I'm not at work. When I'm not in my pajamas, um, I like to wear steampunk. I love the steampunk clothing. I love shopping at the Pyramid Collection. And if you don't know what that is, it's a really cool store. They have lots of cool clothes and stuff for females. <laughs> but um, I like dressing in steampunk. And, uh, you know, I miss going to holiday parties with my hubby and wearing my vintage looking steampunk stuff so yeah all right back to sneak peeks with misty that it's going to be you see it looks like hardware a big over exaggerated length so when you put it in it definitely has that musings vibe it's got a really good length to make it a statement this is a beautiful necklace i love this for all of you who adore malibus this has a fun array of different materials. So we've got a shell, a pearl, we've got some really cute heart charms, and then we've got some acrylics that are both clear and a little bit more of a milky transparent. No, no, just no. And here's why I say just no. I've already proven that this necklace is I will fly minus the bird. But, you know, she will describe this, you, you know, the same thing 
from three years ago and bring it out in every color just so she can get more sales. You can see all the way through. And I love when different materials are mixed because, again, that color palette is going to be over-exaggerated and then a little bit under-exaggerated depending on the material. So this is a fun summer shade of purple. It's a fun now, summer shade of purple. This yellow ring, how fun is that? It's stone, right? And you can really see that detail around it, all of those scallops. Sometimes it's fun. Today I'm wearing a lapis ring to just pop blue out of my shirt. This is a really fun color to do that. By the way, coming from Seattle and the fact that she's wearing a Nirvana t-shirt, um... Everything Nirvana stood for in their lyrics, if you listen to them, is everything she does, they were against, just saying. So the fact that she's wearing a Nirvana t-shirt, mm, they probably wouldn't be happy about it. And I'm really impressed that she's not showing off her ring on her middle finger. But yes, again, Booyah Boutique, cute little oil slick ring. I paid $7.95 for this and uh, my iridescent earrings, which I took off before I showered last night because I still am in the habit that you can't wear your earrings when you shower, even though those I probably could. That with or to add with silver accessories or if you've got a lot of Yellowstone, this is a fun, fun shape. Now this is a bold statement bracelet. I love it. The two different shapes. Defaced around the sides and then flat on top is really going to give it that high sheen and high pop of light. And again, you're going to see that from across the room, especially because it's such a strong color, right? And it's a great neutral. Anytime we have neutrals, it goes with a lot of things. Now, this All is a beautiful things. set that will be available today. I love this crystal. It's so, so pretty. It's half clear, half clear gray on one side and then hematite on the other side. So it's not crystal, it's glass or plastic, not crystal. So the fact that she's calling her cheap ass $5 jewelry crystal is false, it is completely false. So Misty Kirby, um, if you're gonna describe the jewelry, describe it accurately because that is not crystal. You're really gonna get a lot of bouncing light through it, which I think is important and again, you can stack this one if you want. You certainly have a lot of accessories that you can pair it with. So fun, but again, fun to have that set as well. Last but not least, a color or a Pantone that we're utilizing this season, Leprechaun. So fun, very big, bright pop of color. I was in a mall recently and you can see Leprechaun in tons and tons of stores. She was in a mall recently. What mall did you go to? Because the only mall that I know of in St. George, Utah is the Cliffs Mall, and it's an outdoor mall, and it's an outlet mall. So my guess is, is you drove your butt to Las Vegas and went to the, uh, the expensive malls, the resort world <laughs> mall. I don't know. But um, Leprechaun Green, don't think so. Forever 21, H&M, Zara were just a few that I really noticed. Not okay, Forever 21 and H&M, known for their quality goods. <laughs> All right, so I've had enough of sneak peeks with Misty, so we're good there. Let's go to the Paparazzi Founders page because I want to see what... Motivational Monday was for last week and work at Wednesday and all that other good stuff. So let's just go to the Founders page, see what they had to say. All right, go to photos. These are the uh, Black Diamond bringbacks. So let's see what they've got. Um, it looks like, wow, this one's old. Uh, it's a little moon. Ashley, why are you commenting on that? That's interesting. And then we've got the oil slick uh, Life of the Party bring backs. Again, bread and butter. Ooh, um, this is, uh, it should be a blockbuster. I think it's copper or gold, but it's a Life of the Party bring back. And then we're bringing back the studs in black. And then uh, that looks like the same beads that are on the necklace that I got. Um, in that starter kit someone sent me. Oh, by the way, it's, uh, the contents finally left. Work hard to get what you like, otherwise you'll be forced just to like what you get. Yeah, that's true. N hashtag no excuses. 
Life is too short live the same, to live the same day twice. Motivational Monday. Um, okay. If I could live the same day twice, what day would you relive? Me personally, uh, the day that I would relive over and over again in my brain is the day my husband and I, uh, gosh, we did a canal cruise in Amsterdam and we had a romantic canal cruise and dinner. But we spent that entire day you know, walking through museums, holding hands, being romantic. Um, that's one of the days that I, I truly enjoy. I relive that day over and over. One, because it's in Amsterdam, and two, because I was with, you know, my best friend in the whole world. Another life of the party bring back. Woo. Ooh, another bread and butter piece, oil slick. Those are ugly. I remember having those in my store. That's ugly, too. Again, with the oil slick. What is going on with the oil slick? We know that this shit's going to sell, so we're going to bring it back. S success is a slow process, and quitting doesn't speed it up. <clears throat> okay. Um, quitting something can speed up success in your life. Say you quit a bad habit. That is success. Uh, say you quit a multi-level marketing company and you stop throwing money down the toilet. That's success. But see, they don't want you to quit because you are their customer. All right. Once you choose hope, anything is possible. The Kool-Aid comments. Ugh. Oh, look, we have another mom piece. Yay! And this is the life of the party bringing back. I remember when this was the life of the party that I got in my box. That set didn't sell out. Oh, another life of the party bring back. The butterflies are back. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I have that in smoky gray. <laughs> really? Action is the foundational key to all success. Yes. If you want to lose weight, you need to take action to do that by moving your body, drinking more water, you know, exercising. <laughs> Don't count the days, make the days count. Well, you can count down the days to when you're going to be doing something super duper fun, like going on vacation or, you know, doing something new. Ugh. Ugh. Really? I'm sorry. <laughs> oh my goodness. The oil slick. Everything is oil slick. It's like, oh. I remember the day that dropped. The only place where success comes before work is in the dictionary. Really? Okay. These platitudes. Success. Who is successful in a multi-level marketing company? The people who are very early signer-uppers, just, it's the truth. You signed up at the very beginning, like the Franks. Um, you are successful because you are automatically generational. You automatically get people below you because you signed up first, and then the people you signed up signed up other people. But you will always be at the top of that pyramid, okay? You know, your rank comes from you preying on other people. Even if you're on the right track, you'll get run over if you just sit there. Really? Okay. The best view comes after the hardest climb. I've read this one before. All right. What you doing, Bubby? Lily's over there scratching. Okay. So they asked on April 6th, what's the one thing you do every single day for your paparazzi business? I'm going to read some of the Kool-Aid comments here because uh, it's, it's, it's kind of disgusting. So I pray over it. I pray for all Papa consultants. I create sets for my live shows. I plan for future events like live shows. I also have the opportunity. Uh, I also share the opportunity, every opportunity I get. And I post on social media at least three times a day. I would be blocking her butt or unfollowing right away because, ugh. 
every day. I post to my business page story, a feature, a piece of video, and I do my live schedule. And then here's the usual girl, Nora. I go live. She loves to put her consultant ID. Last night was my 469th live. Oh, God. Uh, get out of bed. Some days it's easier than others. My dreams are usually paparazzi related, so I roll out of bed, put the dreams into action seven days a week. My guess is Vicky either suffers from chronic pain or some form of illness, and she does this to keep herself busy. But again, I pray daily over my business. Prayer, I'm sorry, is not going to make you successful. And, okay, a lot of these are all prayer related. Go ahead and pray. Okay, go ahead and do you, boo. But the thing is, is prayer is not going to find you new customers. And being blasphemous is not going to help your business. Okay, you know, there's a reason that uh, people are not affiliating with religion much anymore. Because people uh, extort religion or pervert the religion. And a lot of people are leaving religion because they don't like the perversion of it. Hmm. All right. So I was going to show you guys um, my favorite. This is one of my favorite steampunks, okay? This is the Pyramid Collection. Aren't those boots just absolutely fabulous? I mean, they have a lot of cool stuff. And if you've ever seen the movie Hugo, the clothes and stuff from the movie Hugo remind me very much of steampunk, okay? But this is the Pyramid Collection, and you can get a lot of really cool stuff from the Pyramid Collection. This is one of my favorite jackets and I wear it with jeans and it's fun so I mean it's got a lot of detail it's really really fun but you know this this collection if you just you know if you want to look for something different and unique there's lots of fun stuff on this you know website and you know it's just pretty we've got the uh, the Bridgerton slave dress, but I love it. Okay, and they have jewelry, a lot like paparazzi, but better. So anyway, that's my 10, 20, 35 cents for today. Oh, let's round it up and let's make it my 45 cents for the day <laughs> instead of 45% commission, 45 cents. Uh, you guys, thanks for joining me for the sneak peeks with Misty, the Kool Aid comments, and uh, of course the hidden gems and all that other dumb stuff. Um, TikTok videos with paparazzi consultants is flooding social media. The Franks are going mad, you know, balls to the walls crazy with them. So it's it's getting to the point where it's like, I, I can't do it anymore. So if you see someone advertising a multi-level marketing company on TikTok, Instagram, uh, it's against their rules of conduct, please report them so they're taken down or stopped. Because we need to band together to stop this from happening. Anyway, have a great day, guys. Stay sassy. Keep it classy. Bye.